Well, when it comes to tournament fishing, you never know what the conditions are going to be. It always changes. It's always tough. I tell you what, on that same tournament, it was a cold, miserable day. No question about it. When we were out there filming, it was cold. It was windy and it was tough. Let's take a look at one of the fishermen. It gives us a little insight of what his day was like at the tournament weigh-in. Three fish for ten and a half pounds. That's not a bad average. Why don't you hold a couple up and show everybody what these look like, and then we'll talk a little bit about what took place, and we'll get these back over for the DNR. A couple of nice fish. These are the ones that we were just talking about. Good shape. We'll get these back in the basket and get them over to the DNR. Talk a little bit about uh, those conditions out there today. It's kind of like ice fishing without uh, the hard water. I've been on a lot of ice fishing trips warmer than this, so that was pretty brutal in the morning, but turned out to be okay. Well, one of the things people were asking a little while ago, we saw the trailers this morning after the boats left, and there's icicles hanging off the back of the trailers. How do you keep everything working in the boat, and how do you keep lines from freezing up and that kind of thing? Not easy, but I think keeping water flowing through the boat and keeping them water going through the live wells kept everything thawed. And, of course, the wind makes for a little tough out there boat riding as well. Correct. Uh, there's a few stretches of river that are way rougher than others, and there was a few spots where it was real nice. Were you able to fish the uh, same kind of water you did pre-fishing, or did the cold weather uh, change some of that? Changed almost all of it. We ended up fishing a couple completely different spots. That's where we ended up catching all the fish, so changed everything. All right, good luck tomorrow. Here's your bag, and we'll see you at the ramp. Thanks.